It could be argued that the NEO or new engine option lineup of Airbus aircraft, particularly the A320 NEO family, is one of the best decisions the plane maker has made in its history of building commercial jets. Revising its existing A320 family greatly boosted aircraft efficiency and gave it a competitive edge over Boeing, all without the higher development costs of a clean sheet design. This strategy was also carried to its older wide body, the A330, although it hasn't seen the same runaway success. Could Airbus one day do this to the A350 and offer an A350neo? In terms of clean sheet designs, the A350 is one of the newest members of the Airbus family. Yes, the Bombardier C-Series launched after and also joined Airbus as the A220 more recently, but as far as pure Airbus designs go, the A350 is the latest. The aircraft first flew in 2013 and entered service with Qatar Airways in 2015. Therefore, it could be argued that the wide body is still too new to need a new engine option as its technologies are already fairly current. However, it's guaranteed that this won't last forever. Boeing will eventually see the first delivery of its 777X, an aircraft that boasts huge efficiency and capacity gains. Airbus will want to ensure its A350-1000, the most direct rival to the 7979 in its offerings, can offer similar numbers to hold the interest of airlines. However, the idea of an A350neo is not something vague and futuristic. Airbus has been seriously considering the proposition for several years now, and engine makers like GE have been floated for the project. It was actually in November 2018 when the idea of the A350neo was first floated. By 2019, it was revealed that Airbus and GE were discussing a new engine for the A350, perhaps one derived from the massive GE9X power plant. Covid quickly dashed any notion of a quick design process, and everything was put on the back burner. However, we're now out of those dark days of the pandemic, with travel surging. With wide bodies keeping busy in the skies globally, the A380 edging closer to retirement, and the 777X on the horizon, Airbus might well be considering reviving the A350neo project. While the A330neo features the Rolls-Royce Trent 7000 engines, the A350neo could see GE power plants given the previous engagement between the pair. However, any discussion right now is pure speculation. In 2019, Airbus told us the following about the A350neo. As a leading aircraft manufacturer, we are always looking into advancing our aircraft or offerings to the benefit of our customers keep our aircraft on the leading edge and enhancing value. There is no pressure as the A350 is today the aircraft of choice given its unprecedented track record and excellent customer feedback. GE, Safran, Rolls-Royce and Pratt & Whitney are all working on their future engine designs. Rolls-Royce is working on its Ultrafan, while GE is still working to perfect its 9X. Thus, it seems only a matter of time before Airbus unveils an A350neo project. The aircraft has already racked up over 900 orders, more when you include the new freighter variant. Do you think we'll see an A350neo from Airbus? Share your thoughts by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.